Alright, this example says find the vertex, the focus, and directrix of each parabola. Graph the equation by hand and by using a graphing utility. Well, we're not going to use a graphing utility because actually these are so much easier to graph out by hand than to try and put them into your um, calculator any day of the week. Alright, we need to look at our equation to start with because this is what we're given. We're given x squared equals negative 4y. Alright, we have to think about this equation and what we know just from this. And I can tell you that from this equation you should be able to see which way it will open automatically. Remember, you had two different forms of the standard form of a parabola. One was where the x value was squared. The other one was where the y value was squared. So this one is where the x value is squared. So that tells us it's either going to open up or down. Because this is a negative, that tells us that this is going to open in the downward position. So we know right now that this thing opens down. We know that much. All right. Also, because of the way that the equation, the you know, kind of like generic standard form, let me go ahead and write that out. Uh, that's x minus h squared equals plus or minus 4a times y minus k. Because of the way that this is written, we can tell automatically what our um, h and k values are. h is what's being subtracted from the x's. There is nothing here. That tells us that our vertex, the x-coordinate, is zero. Because it's the same thing as saying x minus zero. Now for the y's. There is nothing being subtracted here from the y, so that says that the k value is zero also. That means we know that our vertex is at zero, zero. We also know from this formula, this is our 4a position, which matches up with that 4 there. Now I'm not going to worry about the positive or negative, because remember that just tells us which way it opens. So we know in this case that 4a has to equal 4, which means that a equals 1. Well, remember, a is the distance from the vertex to the focus. And if this thing opens down, that means our focus is one unit down from the vertex. That would be the point 0, negative 1. We also know that because the lattice rectum is 4a units long, that means that it's 4 units long in this case. Half on one side, half on the other side of the focus. This time uh, the lattice rectum is going to be horizontal because, so that it will, um, so that parabola will be opening down. Now we can label those points as being negative 2, negative 1. And, oh, yeah, negative 2, sorry, negative 1, and positive 2, negative 1. We can also list out our directrix because if it is a units one direction to the focus, it is a units the other direction to the directrix line. So that says it's one unit backwards, or up in this case, to the directrix. So our directrix then would be the line y equals a positive 1. And now we have answered all of the questions and done the graph at the exact same time.